Welcome back to another episode here on the existence. Hello, I'm trying to do an intro. SMP server. This is episode two. Um, starting out right now, it's nighttime. Still don't have a sword. Um, but we are going to be doing some building today. And I'm actually taking a lot of inspiration from this building right here. Uh, I'm, I think it's multiple people helped with this, but the main builder, I believe, was Yogg Hurt. Uh, so, yeah. I really like this uh, brick and granite, so I'm going to build something a little bit like this, but give it my own, you know, flair to it uh, over there. And then uh, I'll probably do a little bit of terraforming or stuff, or maybe that'll be uh, the episode after that. But it does have bricks, and I actually really I want to use these, because I haven't got the chance to use the scaffolding yet. I want to really learn how it works but it uses a lot of brick uh, which means we're gonna have to go out and hunt for clay so that is my first task for today I'm gonna go hunt find some clay and uh, bring it all back and then we can tear down some trees and then get started on working on our base here our little starter home all right guys I am back and as you can tell we are getting straight into working on our house here let me take out these creepers really quickly Cool, that one was close. Oh, yep, I saw that. Uh, it doesn't matter, all this is going to get covered up anyways. Um, essentially, what I've done is I have put down the first layer, uh, or at least the layout, kind of, uh, of our house here. So really, you know, these are going to be pillars that go way up. Uh, but yeah, it's a, just a decent sized house, you know, a little thing. And it's not straight in town, the town's right over there really. Uh, there's a post office this is the little cobblestone area i had marked off i've taken the cobblestone down so anything else around here that isn't my base uh is open for anyone to build in or do whatever they want to do uh but yeah so i'm gonna work on this and probably do you know the first uh like couple layers or so all the way around and uh, it's mainly going to be the brick part uh, if I do decide to do the brick, which I'm pretty sure I am going to do, but it really depends on uh, how it looks when I'm placing it down, because I, unlike most things that I build, I have not built this yet. Uh, I've just got an idea of it in my head. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to get to work, and I'll show you guys when I have a little bit of progress. Alright, so I have been working uh, quite a bit, as you can see, and I've got, you know, a good brick foundation in. Uh, I really, I'm, I'm really pleased with the brick on the bottom and then the stone on top depending on what you guys say i could change the brick out for stone on the bottom but you know with the new textures and stuff i i think we should give these blocks a little bit of love so yeah i'm doing that uh for now and i've got one of the sides built kind of i mean just the front facade and i'm starting to wrap around that way and i'm going to do this side now and work on it and then the main section after that so i'm gonna keep working and when i've got a little bit more progress i'll bring you guys back but i'm really happy with the, how this is starting to look all right i have been doing quite a bit of work but actually not on the house i've done some more terraforming right here i'm actually not sure if i'm going to keep this arch like this and ha run a path through it or if i'm going to close it up and then make this a little pasture for like cows and sheep and stuff it depends on if someone makes a cow and sheep farm over there in the farming district once, you know, everyone's little starter things get, you know, torn down and, you know, we start doing like actual projects and stuff like this is like really, really nice. And there's some really nice things uh, starting to pop up around, which is really, really cool, really, really fun and like exciting to be here on the existence server. Uh, once again, just got to extend my thanks to everyone here for inviting me on it. It's, a, it's gonna be an amazing time uh with these guys so yeah i'm gonna keep working i think i'm going to do the other side of this um just you know we can do a little bit on camera uh so i can just kind of show you guys my process most of the time i like to uh bring the dirt down a few blocks from what it's up from what it is on there if i could see that would help um i haven't got really used to using scaffolding yet um Braden, good old pal, uh, has told me I really should, you know, test it, give it a try because it'll help me out a lot, especially for the type of stuff I do. I just haven't gotten around to crafting any with like bamboo or whatnot yet. Uh, but yeah, I will definitely be using it in the future, I'm sure. Uh, 
I'll get more accustomed to the new things in 1.14. Now this right here is not good. Here, I'm going to show you why. It's it's uniform. It's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4. It's like a perfect diagonal. That's not good. So we got to break it up. And I think I'll do that with some stone. Uh, I'll have a little spike run all the way up through the dirt uh, for this one. And then, of course, detail it up. Uh, you know, with the stairs and slabs and stuff like that. And I can show you on this side how where I've done that at. Like here, I did the same thing pretty much on the exact other side of this because I, I was faced with the same issue in that corner. So, yeah. I'm going to keep working on this, guys. And I will come back when I've done some more work on this in the house. Alright, guys. I have fully completed the exterior of the house and the landscaping for this part. So... Big reveal, there it is. Nothing too special. Uh, a bit bigger than most starter houses, uh, but I really like it. I've got some terraforming wrapping around where necessary. Uh, but now I just want to work on a little bit of a path really quickly to end off the episode uh, with you guys. I want it to uh, just like come up here. Uh, just swing around into the house. Nothing special, uh, like I was saying. Do I have some dirt? I want that to be like that. Thanks. He was sleeping for us. Alright, um, let's... Ooh, do I have something I can put there? Let's get a piece of granite really quick. There we go. Okay, buddy. I'm a little busy. Okay. Grab our granite. And we can continue on. Uh, so I'm gonna do this. And yeah, I'm for the slabs to make a staircase up, and then for the actual like path block itself, I'm gonna be using a granite and stone mixture. Uh, we actually decided like all the paths around town. We we did a little vote, you know, came up with a few ideas, and we voted, and just a normal like gravelly stone mixture uh, is the winner. So that's what we're gonna be doing. Uh, so I can throw in stone bricks even mainly in spots that uh dirt would fall through okay so let's do a little bit of stone not too much though because we already have the stone and cobblestone slabs there let's do cobblestone as well throw one here and then we will do the rest just gravel like so and uh, next episode and in future, I'll probably switch over to just using uh, 16 by 16 default textures, um, just because I can easy more easily make edits to that texture, those textures like uh, a crosshair replacement and stuff because they already exist, and I can just add it to the pack. But in Faithful, it would be weird because the pixels would be smaller uh, for all the GUI and stuff, and I don't want that. So. That's why I won't be doing it like that. Uh, I actually think I should wrap that around like this and get rid of that block there. And really same with this. Or I can throw in a cobblestone block like that. So yeah, that looks nice. Say welcome back to Sandman. And let's keep working here just a little bit more. Uh, next episode, I'm probably going to be working on uh, connecting bridges up everywhere and you know starting to do some paths around our little spawn area here around the river um, for the community to really bring us all together uh, here on the uh, this nice new map uh, that we're playing on let's see can I bring this out one just to get a little bit of difference so let's do this Grab some stone bricks and throw a few in. And stone. I'm not going to be doing andesite. Um, other members can. Uh, I just don't like the grainy andesite texture against the gravel. So I'm not going to be doing it that. So let's grab gravel now. And I'm having a little bit of lag. Frame rate lag every single time I place blocks. Which is not very nice. Uh, but I'm sure it'll get fixed here in patches and stuff. Maybe my render distance is just too high for when I'm recording. Uh, but regardless, um, really enjoying the update so far. And uh, a lot of the new 
blocks and features like you know um yeah like this i love that uh slabs and stuff for pretty much anything you want and stairs for pretty much anything you want that's like a stone base because of the stone cutter block but yeah so i'm going to continue this path on uh and just go down and around but i will show you guys all of that work at the beginning of the next episode because unfortunately that's all the time i have for this episode if you enjoyed it please feel free to give me a rating uh comment down below what you want to see from me uh subscribe if you really enjoyed it and as always thanks for watching Thank you.